Good morning. We are going to get a load of green feed, which is rye. So we've been green chopping some rye right here for the last maybe week. Just a little yeah, bit to feed every day. Over a week. Um, yeah. And I see uh, flag leaf is just starting to come out here. And that head's actually coming out underneath the flag leaf. Yeah, it is. But you look here, like the majority of these, I mean, the, the head is, the head's close. Yeah. So. What I have is there's two different types of grasses planted in here. Um, I don't know if you can really see it. Well, we have... This is a ryegrass. Ryegrass is a shorter. Shorter. And you can see it, it, it. Yeah, it's all there. It was planted right in with the cereal rye. Yeah, so what we did is we broadcasted uh, 100 pounds to acre of cereal rye. And then I did uh, 25 pounds of ryegrass. So if we walk up here a little ways, I think we can see the ryegrass a little better. Or actually, maybe right along the edge yeah, here. That's your ryegrass. I think we can see it. It's kind of the got a little different color. Yep. A little more green. Uh, yeah. so basically, basically the ryegrass. Yeah, it's probably. I don't even know. Oh, here's some. About halfway up. Yeah, it's about halfway. And I'm kind of. Ryegrass is very high in energy. So I wanted to do a mix and I wanted to try that this year. Because we did it uh, two years ago or a year ago? Last year. Last year. And it did, the cows did really well on it. So I know that uh, <clears throat> we're going to mow this. I'm hoping, probably not to, tomorrow, but the next day, I'm hoping to mow. Mow it all down. Yep. Try to get it before it actually heads. Heads. I mean, like. like I mean, it's okay if there's a few, few right? Yeah, it's like, because you look here, like this one's just starting. Oh, yep, you can see this one. But it's coming out below the flag leaf, and that's what I don't understand why it's doing that. Maybe because of the heat, I wonder. But here, there's nothing, yeah, nothing headed. So it's getting, I mean, Getting time. A couple days here. So. So, yeah, we're gonna go mow some, chop off. We just do like a round yep. and then chop it off and that gets us about a half a truckload and that'll feed us uh well we're feeding the key it's it's like ninety today, so uh it's in the upper eighties today. Well I saw ninety three. Oh. So uh we're using this to just feed fresh to the cows and we're feeding it pretty heavy right now. So uh, that's why a half a truck is about what we feed a day. And they love it. Yep. <clears> okay. <throat> While he mows that, I'm gonna get the chopper started.
cows just eat this stuff up. It smells so good too. There's our pile. Now this will get eaten fresh right away. We'll feed this up today. Maybe be a little bit left over for tomorrow and we'll do it all over again tomorrow. Well, today we are mowing the rye. So we have two big fields that we're going to mow down today. Should be able to get it done this afternoon. And that's if everything goes all right. And uh, yeah, I'm gonna do one field and Ethan is gonna do the other field. Um, both of these fields are rye, cereal rye with rye grass planted in it we'll mow it and then let it sit for a few days to dry out then we'll harvest it by chopping it some of you will ask why we mow it down and then chop it why not just chop it rye is kind of wet and it needs time to dry um, to be a good quality feed for the animals if it gets too if it's too wet then it does not make for good feed so that's what we're working on thick in some spots like this the other day it was really windy and um, some of it blew over but the hay vine can um, mow it down pretty good so I don't really have an issue with it if it's laying down a little bit and I see that this is really good right here but uh, there was a spot, couple wet spots down in the low ground and I noticed that where um, it was wet, the cereal rye didn't perform quite so well and um, the rye grass, the annual rye grass did really well so it kind of made up for it. So yeah, it's a good thing to plant the two of them together seems to be, um, they seem to be, they seem to grow pretty well together, so I've got to finish, um, I'm probably three quarters of the way done, probably got another half hour, 45 minutes, and then I'll be done. 